It's Christmas approach and Nigerians have continued to lament the rising cost of food items. In recent times, prices have almost doubled due to rising inflation and insecurity in agricultural areas. Our correspondent Jacinta Abeku went to some of the markets in Lagos for a survey. This is Balogun Market, Lagos Island, where you can buy anything you can think of in the city of Lagos. And market rush here is usually very huge and overwhelming. Of course, we all know why Christmas is here, but we want to find out more about the prices of different items. Sadly, the usual Christmas rush is not as expected. With just a few days to Christmas, traders are lamenting low patronage. Prices of foodstuffs and other household goods are on the rise. Something of a one five, now we are selling it three thousand, two five. So people are not buying it more. Someone that wants to buy five, it will buy two. There's no money to buy things, you know, though we manage ourselves to come inside the market to pick one or two things to celebrate our Christmas. This Christmas season, we have to beg God to help us because there is no market. Last year was was fair, but this time around was ah three times I have all these things we they buy and thirty five before now seven thousand. How woman be where born five picking? You go take buy seven seven thousand buy clothes for children. Valungun Market is the heart of Lagos Island, perhaps the largest market in the city. Here, locally made and imported fabrics, shoes, bags, and other fashion accessories can be purchased. Our next port of call is Oyimbo Market. The traders also express that the prices of edibles and other cooking ingredients are shooting up. Rice, granite oil, tomatoes, pepper, chicken, beef, and many others now cost a fortune. Formerly, they used to buy this carrot, a bag, 4,035. But now they will buy it 20,000, 40,000, 30,000, depending. The way things are going now is really affecting even the turnover and sales. Tomatoes are supposed to cost down this time around. As we are bringing it, we have to pay money for transportation. Pay money for Allah Baru. How do we cope? And we have to pay money for the people that assist us. Pay money for the Lylon. It's not easy. You know that foreign rice is not easy to come by. And Nigerian rice is even worse. Because for you to have a good Nigerian rice now, you are talking of 27,000 naira. This year now, we are selling 3,002. But last year, we sell 2,005. The traders review that the closer you tight celebration, the higher the prices of foods and other items. They are calling our government for quick intervention. Jacinta Obiuku for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.